Okay, let's check in backstage. Harp, Hummingbird, and Hedgehog. One of you will return next week as king or queen. The other two will return to their respective celebrity compounds. The next singer to be unmasked is the Hedgehog. Oh! Hedgehog, we hate to see you go, but we're excited to see who you are. But before we get to that, panelists, I need your final guesses. I'm still sticking with my Love Actually cast. I'm doubling down on Bill Nye. I love Bill this Nye. guy. Ken, you're shaking your head no. Yeah, the clues are all about being UK royalty, so especially with the Queen of England image. So this is either, you know, Prince Harry, which just came to me just now, you can just okay. You can just All let right, that. You don't like that? It's Elton John. Let that go right on by. Don't like that either. Unlike you, I'm still standing. This tiny dancer is Elton John. Ah. Robin, I saw the the suit of armor, and um, I'm thinking Monty Python and the Holy Grail. I think this is Eric Idle. Monty Python also, but I'm thinking John Cleese. He's been photographed with the Queen. Yeah. He's won a ton of awards. Yeah. I think we're on the same wavelength, but I, I, Different I really vocal think it's John tones. Cleese. Different vocal tones. Okay, panel. You've given us your final I guesses. Let's see Bye. if any of you are correct. Hedgehog. We gotta know, who are you? Who are you, Hedgehog? Who is it? Audience, Tell us say now. it with me. Take it off. Take it off. Take it off. I guess it was hot under there, huh? It's a little hot in there, yeah. And uh, actually, this is John Cleese's real body. <laughs> <laughs> Robin, you got it right. Robin, sick. Thank you, thank you. My father was the biggest Monty Python fan, and he turned me on to you guys when I was about 10 years old. I've seen every Monty Python movie. Me I've too. even shown them to my son now. Aww. I'm a huge fan, and I know your voice like the back of my hand. Well, Aww. thank you. Truly a comedic genius, a legend. Is there anything you want to say to your fans at home or to our panel? I wanted to sing the song because it's Paul McCartney's first song he ever wrote. And so I, I wrote to him and asked him if I could do it. Oh, wow. I, I had a letter back saying, yes, you can do the song, but would you please tell me what show it is so I can make sure to avoid it? <laughs> <laughs> well, you did an outstanding job. Here to perform Unmasked once and for all with the song I think we all know from the iconic film, The Life of Brian, the artist formerly known as The Hedgehog. It's the legendary Eric Idol! Woo! Some things in life are bad that could really make you mad. Other things just make you swear and curse. When you're chewing on life's gristle, don't grumble, give a whistle. And this'll help things turn out for the best And Always look on the bright side of life Wow! Yes! Oh, yes! Always look on the light side of life If life seems jolly rotten There's something you've forgotten And that's to laugh and smile and dance and sing but when you're feeling in the dumps, don't be silly chumps. Just purse your lips and whistle, that's the thing. And always look on the bright side of life. Come on. Hey! Always look on the bright side of life.
Head over to our VIP section, Mr. Idol.